Hello everyone, welcome to our channel Tutorials College. Uh, this is a very short video that we are going to do and in this video we are going to set up our VS code for Laravel framework based application development. So there are a couple of things that we need usually to help get our things done. So let's get it started. So the first plugin that we need is the Laravel extension pack because our upcoming project is based on the Laravel. So we would be needing that. It is from Vimy Lim and it is a pack of I think seven projects. And Laravel extension. Yep, this is. So I think they have updated uh, and there are more packages in that editor config vs code .me was not there last time and so I think we would go with almost all of these because this is one of the most downloaded and very renowned developer once these are installed we would be going for a theme maybe a style RVS code. I like this cobalt two thing. Of course, you can choose one that you like. And the another set of packages that I'm going to be using, though it is not necessary for everyone. Microsoft Remote Development. This is a pack of three application and uh, three plugins. Okay, here it is. A remote SSH, dead containers, and dead user. So, what uh, this package does is it allows you to connect to a web server or a remote server where your files are located. So, it will ask for your SSH credentials and it will connect directly to that server and that server will act as a directory to this VS code and then of course we, we can browse the application and then we can obviously make necessary developmental or bug improvement changes so it is a very useful package in fact if you have a bug in your live application and you know that it is a very small change that you need to make to access it I think this is going to save the day Thank you so much uh, for watching my video. This is it. And we'll see you in the next video. Please share our video. Like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you. Thanks once again.